Well, today's Friday, last day of the week. Whew, I guess it's time to get ready for the day. things first, always never forget the name badge. There we go. Okay, so welcome uh, to the Blue Mountains Hotel School front office. Um, today I actually need to come here and check out of my school account. And every week you check in and check out so the students learn more about front office operations. And this also means that I settle my account for any money I have owing in terms of uh, if I've used any uh, phone call from my room, if I've purchased any drinks from the student bar, or any coffees or teas from the student cafe at night time. Um, here you'll also be able to pay off your printing bill and maybe if you've done any extra uh, billing such as dry cleaning or things like that. So I've just got to come and check out now. Hi, good morning, Neil. Morning, sir. I'd just like to check out for my account. Certainly, sir. The room number, please. Uh, 406. So you don't have any um, charges on your account? Okay. Would you like me to cut your key? Please. please. Thank you, sir. And so what Neil's doing now is he's actually recutting my key for the next week for my room. So um, every week when you do come and uh, check out, um, they will recut your key for you, and which basically means you can get into your room for the next week. <coughs> Thank you very much. Have a nice day. Uh, my name's Tim. I'm the current SRC president. Um, one thing we organised this semester was a boy band fundraiser. We got four of us to uh, dress up in white suits and sing a number of boy band songs from the Backstreet Boys and uh, take that, etc. Um, it was good fun. We got up, we raised a thousand dollars for Salabi, our uh, sister hotel school. <laughs> Here we have student services. Um, now this is where you can organise anything to do with uh, any documents to do with University of New England or University of Queensland and also for any inter international students this is where uh, they process all your visa documents things like that. Good morning ladies. Good morning. Hi my name is Vega Almog. I'm from Norway doing level 2 practical housekeeping at the moment. Uh, in my spare time, I like being down at the soccer field. One of my best moments of this year was playing uh, the Wrestle World versus Asia, where you was truly scored three goals and pretty much sank the ship for Asia. Okay, so at the moment, I'm actually in one of the career development offices. And what that means is this is where students can come and organize their industry placements. And of course, you do a six-month industry placement at the end of your first year and a six-month industry placement at the end of your second year. So myself, personally, um, through these offices, I was able to organize to go to Morton Island and work at Tangaluma Wild Dolphin Resort for my first placement. And my second placement actually went to Four Seasons Resort in Whistler, which is, of course, in Canada. And so that's organized through here. And, of course, um, our wonderful lecturers, career development offices, they help you so much. And through... And this is really important because through this you can really organise uh, amazing career opportunities so when you finally graduate from the Blue Mountains Hotel School and they will always help you along the way and they're a great contact to have for professional networking in the future. Alright, so welcome to the Blue Mountains Hotel School Quadrangle. Obviously this is the central part of our campus and we have dormitories all around, we have the student library behind us, uh, we have restaurants over here to my left, and I've 
obviously we have this beautiful space out here in which students eat lunch out here. We have beautiful barbecues and whatnot. We've got housekeepers working on dormitories up here. And really is, this is the central hub of our campus. Hi, my name's Anton. I'm from Italy. Um, the school's really nice. Uh, I like the uh, natural surroundings. Um, gives, there's some good opportunities to uh, do some hiking, some walks around the areas, especially Sublime Point where you get a good view of um, the whole valley. And uh, it's really nice by the moonlight and stuff. And uh, yeah, I recommend it to anyone looking to get away from the school for a little while. Okay, and welcome to our games room here on campus. Now this is a great space for basically students to relax, socialize with other students. You can play table tennis, we have air hockey, pool tables, foosball, but we've got it all up here. And really it's a good time just to let out some stress, enjoy some time with your friends, and pretty much just, you know, get away from your everyday social, uh, other commitments and just have some fun. We're in one of our two computer labs. Now this computer lab is fitted out all with uh, new Dell computers. There's a printer at the end so students can print from these computers to their printer. As you can see there's actually a, a small lecture going on at the moment so uh, students, this is also a learning environment for students and this is available um, after hours for students to come and access the internet, email and do research for their assignments. Okay, and welcome to our second of our computer labs. Now, this computer lab has been fitted out with all the latest um, Apple Mac computers. And this is a great space for students to come and study and uh, perform group work if they need to. And, of course, all the computers are onto the network, so we've got email and can access the school internet site and any other research databases um, offered to us. Uh, this lab is also offered um, to students for um, out-of-class times. So at night time, you'll often find all the students in here working away and really it is, it, is a, it is a great place to study. Okay, now welcome to one of the students' rooms. It's actually being cleaned by one of our level 2 housekeepers at the time. So as you can see, they're taught in all housekeeping operations. Uh, they get real hands-on experience. We have supervisors coming around, checking their work. And they are actually assessed on what they're doing. I think um, our old friend here is actually doing quite a good job. And really this also means that every student goes to, who goes through the course does learn housekeeping operations and so it also ensures the cleanliness of our student rooms at all times. three food and beverage outlets all found on campus. We have our buffet restaurant uh, which has a serving of hot and cold foods. We have our fine dining restaurant which is an a la carte menu and finally we have our cafe which is open for lunch times. All students work at each of the food and beverage outlets whilst during their training and all students also eat at each of the outlets while staying on campus. Thanks for joining me on my day today. Unfortunately, I have an exam tomorrow, so I need to do some study before I go to bed tonight. But I hope to see you soon at the Blue Mountains Hotel School.